Hey everybody, Tommy Castro here. Uh, man, I've been so busy. I, I've been meaning to check in with you guys and let you know what we're up to. You know, we're putting out a, a new album. Uh, it's going to drop next week. It's called Method to My Madness. And uh, we've got a couple of big shows coming up this weekend. One in Napa, California and uh, in San Francisco. It's the record release parties, you know, here in the Bay Area where we live. And then uh, right after that, we're we're jumping on a plane to Florida. We're going to meet up with our bus. We're going to do a couple of gigs on the East Coast. And then we're going to go on the Blues Cruise. And then after the Blues Cruise, we're going to get back up the East Coast and around the Midwest. And uh, we're going to be out there for, no, five or six weeks, you know, uh, going to play all of our favorite places and uh, playing all of our new songs. And we're excited about it. Uh, what I want to tell you about the new album is, uh, this is the method to my madness, is that um, I'd like, I like to do something different each time. Every time I make a new record, I want it to be different than the last record, not just the same thing with new songs, uh, a different uh, approach, a different concept. You know, The last album, The Devil You Know, uh, was a big production. Uh, there was a bunch of special guests. There was some a uh, couple of different pro producers involved. There were uh, different studios involved, and there was a, a, a sound I was going for. Um, Randy McDonald had just come back into the fold. We shifted around the lineup of the band. There was all kinds of stuff going on there. Uh, so that was a big art project. And uh, after doing that, I wanted to do something really straightforward and organic straightforward organic live sounding album where where me and the guys just us four guys no special guests we go in a room uh we take the best songs uh that we've accumulated in the last uh couple of years since the last album uh i, I wrote songs with some of my favorite songwriters we came up with some really cool material and then we just went out there and banged it out as live and real as possible uh, it's as close to a live show as you're going to get in the studio. And uh, we're really happy with the way it turned out. Um, I did a couple of things on there that I haven't done in a long time. Like I did, uh, I wrote a new slow blues. Um, I did a tribute to B.B. King. Uh, so I did a, a basic blues shuffle on there. Um, there's some, uh, well, a lot of different stuff. But uh, I, I did a few things that I haven't done in a long time. And it felt really good. I used one guitar pretty much for the whole recording session, pretty much one amplifier. Uh, I did play slide on one song, so I used a different guitar for that, and, and, I, and I think maybe a different amp for that too, different tone. But um, other than that, everything was done uh, just like we would do at a gig. We just played those songs down, and we recorded it, and that's what the, the new album's all about. We hope you guys would do one of two things, if not both. One, we'd love to see out at a show, and uh, two, uh, buy a copy of the new record. Uh, vinyl will be available in December, they're telling me. Vinyl is so popular again that they can't get those things printed up in time for the new release, even though we had plenty of lead time, uh, and we all knew this was coming, but what we didn't know is that all the, all the pressing plants for vinyl is backed up, so we'll be hitting the road with uh, stacks and stacks of not wax, but CDs. And uh, thank you all very much for listening. I'll see you out there on the road.